For two decades, IEA's TIMS has monitored trends in mathematics and science achievement around the world. Directed by the TIMS and Pearls International Study Center at Boston College, TIMS assesses students at the fourth and eighth grades every four years, with 57 countries and seven benchmarking participants in TIMS 2015. It was the sixth TIMS assessment and a landmark year, encompassing 20 years of trends and giving countries an in-depth look at student performance over time. The assessments reflect how countries organize curriculum, addressing key transition points in schooling, fourth grade, eighth grade, and their final year of secondary school. TIMS Advanced is the only international assessment of students in STEM programs and tracks in their final year of secondary school. It has been conducted three times, and nine countries participated in TIMS Advanced 2015. Altogether, more than 600,000 students were assessed in 2015, based on more than 1,000 achievement items in mathematics and science. TIMS assessments are rooted in countries' mathematics and science curricula and based on countries' shared expectations of what students should know and be able to do. In fourth grade mathematics, the five East Asian countries performed above the rest, Singapore and Hong Kong, followed by Korea, then Chinese Taipei and Japan. A 23-point gap set them apart from the next highest scoring countries. For 20 years, countries have been using TIMS results to improve their education systems. They use TIMS data to stimulate new initiatives and the trend results to monitor the effectiveness of those initiatives. Trends show more countries increasing their achievement across time than decreasing. Short-term trends for fourth grade mathematics show 21 countries had higher average achievement. 15 were unchanged. And 5 decreased. Long-term trends show 14 countries improved, one was unchanged, and two decreased. Singapore led 8th grade mathematics as well, followed by Korea and Chinese Taipei, then Hong Kong, and then Japan. The gap between those top performers and the next highest scoring countries was even wider at the 8th grade, 48 points. Short-term trends in mathematics show 18 countries improved. 13 were the same. And 3 decreased. Long-term trends show 9 countries improved, 4 were the same, and 3 decreased. In 4th grade science, Singapore and Korea outperformed all other countries, followed by Japan and the Russian Federation. Short-term trends in science show 17 countries were up, 16 the same, and 8 countries down. Long-term trends show 11 countries were up, 4 the same, and 2 down. In 8th grade science, Singaporean students were the highest achievers, and Japan and Chinese Taipei also made it to the top, followed by Korea and Slovenia. Short-term trends in science show 15 countries were up, 15 the same, and 4 countries down. Long-term trends show nine countries were up, four the same, and three down. Students who participated in TIMS Advanced were in their final year of secondary school and had taken advanced mathematics or physics courses in preparation for university study and careers in STEM areas. These are very select students, with a percentage of the cohort ranging across countries from 2 to 34 percent for mathematics and from 4 to 22 percent for physics in these advanced programs. In contrast to the peak levels of mathematics achievement at the 4th and 8th grades, the nine countries in TIMS Advanced generally had lower performance overall. With two exceptions, the country's average achievement in mathematics fell below the scale center point of 500 to a low of 422. 
In physics, performance for some countries dipped even lower. The relatively low performance in TIMS Advance 2015 resulted in disappointing trends in both subjects for the countries with 20-year trend data. Half declined and none improved. To report on the mathematics and science that 4th and 8th grade students know and can do, TIMS reports achievement at four international benchmarks – advanced, high, intermediate, and low. Results at the fourth grade were similar for mathematics and science. TIMS 2015 found that more students worldwide are reaching the most challenging benchmarks. Almost all students reach the low international benchmark, which represents a basic level of achievement, but only 6% reach the advanced benchmark in mathematics and 7% in science. Remarkably, of the 17 countries with 20-year trends, 13 raised achievement in mathematics and 8 in science across their entire fourth grade distribution, improving at each of the four benchmarks from low to advanced. Results at the 8th grade were almost as positive and also similar for mathematics and science. On average, countries educated 84% of their students to a basic level of mathematics and science achievement, with 5 to 7% reaching the advanced benchmark. Of the 16 countries with 20-year trends, five raised achievement in mathematics and four in science across their entire grade distribution, improving at each of the four benchmarks. This video provides TIMS 2015 and TIMS Advanced 2015 country comparisons in mathematics and science achievement and trend results over time. To view a video on the TIMS 2015 and TIMS Advanced 2015 results about the home and school contexts for teaching and learning mathematics and science, please visit TIMS2015.org. TIMS and TIMS Advanced are projects of IEA and are based at the TIMS and Pearls International Study Center at Boston College.